Hi, AT from CNC at Home. I wanted to take some time and do a little bit of periodic maintenance on the uh, 3018 Pro router. It's been a while since I've uh, lubed it up a little bit, so I wanted to kind of show you how I do that. I'm going to home it first, and then I'm going to get the vacuum out and do some cleaning up on this. Just to get some of the wood chips and stuff out of there. Do a little bit more than I normally would. Get it all nice and cleaned up. Once it's cleaned up, then I'll spend some time lubricating the jack screws and the uh, bearing rods on there that hold the cutting surface and the gantry in place. Right now I'm moving the working surface as far forward as I can so I can get behind here and clean it. I'm going to spend some time just getting the everything I can, get the gantry, the drag chain, everything cleaned up nicely. Make sure to get the other side of the gantry here. Just going to get some lightweight oil and a paper towel. That's all we really need to get this cleaned up. So I start with the jack screw for the gantry and I just run a light bead of oil across it. And then I'll use the towel to get that cleaned up. One important safety tip here is to make sure the machine is shut off. I know this is a small machine and it's really not going to hurt me too badly. It can hurt me though. And with a bigger machine, it could hurt you. So with any kind of machinery, de-energize it, turn it off, just to make sure that it's not going to do something that's unexpected. So I'm just using that paper towel to, uh, to work that oil in to the, the jack screw and those bearing rods. Once everything's kind of cleaned up, I will uh, power it up and run it around a little bit, make sure that everything is running smoothly. Seems to be doing pretty well. We'll just bring it back to a neutral position here. This is all there really is to cleaning. It doesn't take too much time. I should do it more frequently. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you like the content of our channel, think about subscribing. And have fun doing your CNC at home projects.